I'm back. Um, this is Joe. Uh, some of you might have remembered about a month ago when we were talking about adding these um, additional automation features to the Reflex uh, planter automation system when we talked about how really the Reflex is a total, not just a down pressure control system, but has these additional control channels for um, to become a total automation uh, system for the planter. And today is a really great day because what we're doing is we are taking the last system that uh, it was part of the corn planter that used to be something that a human being would adjust and we're making it automatically adjustable. But this system is the first for us and is different than the down pressure, okay? This is the closing system, okay? And the closing system, the active closing system does not control the pressure on the closing wheels. What it's doing is it's controlling how deep the closing wheels are running in the ground relative to a firming wheel, okay? This is a prototype, this is a concept, okay? And um, we've basically taken the same type of active control concept that we've used in other cases, digital down pressure control, okay? And we are making something that has this wheel that runs in the furrow, okay? Now it's con connected by this linkage to this spring, so we have adjustable preload, and we can control how hard is this uh, firming wheel pressing on the bottom of the furrow, okay? Now, then we have a sensor, just like the active depth control, and we're measuring how deep in the ground the closing wheels are going relative to the firming wheel, okay? And you, you control that set point, and you, you have a dead hand on it, and if the system is um, too, if the closing wheels are too uh, deep, uh, or if there's too much distance in between the closing wheels and the furrow, it'll increase the pressure, and if there's too little, it will decrease the pressure. So we're not controlling the pressure, we're actually controlling the distance. And in that way, you have the seed here, and we're actually controlling the firming action as we go through the field, okay? But Here's the deal, um, it, all of this system, and, and what we've done is we're paving the way for complete autonomous planting. Because now there is no single part of the corn planter that you have to touch. All of these adjustments, whether it be the depth, whether it be the closing system, whether it be the down pressure, whether it be the residue manager, are now things that are automatically controllable. And so um, I wanted to show it to you guys first. Here, uh, Rob, come look at it from this side, okay? Another angle about how we're packaging those components. The closing system uses a small accumulator like we use on the GFX row cleaner. The sensor is here. This wire needs to be protected better, and as we develop this concept, we're, we need to do that. There's a small manifold here, and all of the hoses and wires for both the active depth control system and the active closing system are going to be routed up through here on the exact orange row unit. And then, so the mounting for the the previous piece that had been a cast piece here um, that mounts the closing wheels is now an integrated hydraulic manifold and an actuator with a very small little piston, and. Uh, I'm interested in hearing feedback. Okay, that's all I want to do. We'll uh, see you guys at the National Farm Machinery Show if you're coming.